Hello everybody, I'm Anthony Landreth. I'm Bubba Spencer. And I'm Keith Haywood. Hey, we want to welcome y'all to another Tennessee Outside short clip right here. And tonight what we're going to do, we're going to show you how to score a turkey. This particular bird, since turkey season not, is not open here yet, we can't use a live bird. But we're going to use this, this is a big monster, Wayne County bird right here that my buddy Greg Overton killed. And uh, of course we can't weigh it, but we know it weighed 26 pounds. I talked to Greg today. Hey, Greg lets us keep this out here on our set before we do the show. So uh, I've done got the weight down, so we're going to let Bubba and Keith, and we're going to walk you through how to score a turkey for not only the Apex competition, but the way NWTF scoring rules. And we're so, going to use the Apex turkey tool. Yeah, that's exactly and, right. And, it, and if you look at the Apex turkey tool, it's got a little thing here where it has the uh, scale, just like a fish scale almost. Yep, it is. You can loop this around just like this. Most people are going to do the feet, but you could loop it over the head, pull it tight. Yep. And, that, and, you, and you can do the weight mm -hmm. either way. But like I say, we've done got the weight. It's 26 pounds. So tell you what, let's start out. It, th this is a double bearded bird, yep. so both beards count. So let's go ahead and start out with the, let's get the biggest beard first. Right, Keith, uh, you can get around there, and I'm going to sort of put it here, and I'm going to let you stretch. And we're not going to go all the way in really tight because it's a mounted bird and I don't want to mess it up. Just all the way and see what that longest strand is. And I'll put it on top where we can see what that longest. There you go. What's well, nine and nine and a quarter? So that's, that's nine and four sixteenths because everything's in sixteenths. Yeah. Okay. So it's, uh, it's, and then we got to do the conversion chart for four sixteenths. Right. Tell me when you're ready for the other one. Point two five. You're okay. Right. Mm -hmm. All right. And going. one thing I want to note too, Bub, is you said the longest strand. Because if you strand. got just one strand and it's an inch long and the rest of them, that's what you go by. Okay. I'm going to call that 10 and 16. 10 and 1 16. Mm -hmm. yeah. on, the, on the other one? On the other mm -hmm. one. There's one, one strand. 10.0625. That's going to be sort of. Yeah, get it. Yeah. You ready for the? Yeah, uh, yep, ready for the left is, left spur. Well, let's, let's, do, let's do right spur. Okay, whatever, whatever I, you I'm get right to here. easiest. Right here, come around, come here, Keith, and help me see that. Let's see. I'm gonna say that's, that's one, one and two, two six two, two sixteenths. Six I'm sorry, we yep. do them two sixteenths. Two okay. sixteenths. One point one two five. All right. All right. Now we're gonna, I'm gonna sort of measure that upside down just so. That's okay. okay. That is one in. Well, that's a little longer there. That's longer. I'm going to say three sixteenths. Yep. Yep. One All right. Three sixteenths. That's going to be one and one eight seven five. Okay. And what what you do, the, the weight weighed 26 pounds. So that, that number is going to be 26. All right. And then we're going to take the, let me clear this out, 1.125. I'll hold up you put one comma. Oh. I sure did. 1.125 times 10. Okay, that, that's equal 11.25. That's on the left spur. Yep, and then the other one is going to be 1.1875 times 10, because spurs is times 10. Or the easy way to do it is just move your decimal point over two yeah, times. Yeah, and, and, and that, that, that's, that's yeah. right, too. Yeah, either way. Yeah. <laughs> okay, and the beard is going to be twice the length. So that's going to be 9.25 times 2. 18 and a half. I hear them geese out there. Yeah, I do, too. And then 10.0625. Yep. Times 2. It's gonna be twenty point one two five, and now just gonna add all them up. Twenty six plus eleven point two five plus eleven point two five plus eleven point eight seven five eighteen point five and twenty one, two, five. For a total of. And I'm gonna tell you what, if that had been a single bearded bird at 87, that would be. Really? It be would a, be a yes, false, huh? It sure would. 
It sure would. 87.75 total. That, that's what it scores. And, and just to give you a little idea on that, the let me see, I got one of the records in here somewhere. If I can find it, may not can find it. Oh, while you're looking, let, let's, let's show them what it looks like. Yeah, now. yeah, you can go over and, and show them that. So, yeah, they can see how we added it up. That's the way it goes. But That's a nice bird, and it's a, it's a big bird. You can yeah. That. Well, like I say, Greg killed this one in Wayne County, and Wayne County has some huge ones. Yeah. Here. Yeah. So, all right, folks, that's going to wrap this up for Tussie Outside YouTube clip about how to score a wild turkey. And it's, it's pretty simple. Like I say, just one times the weight, ten times the spur length, two times the beard length. And if you hadn't signed up for the Apex Spring Out Turkey Challenge, sign up. You get the turkey tool. They reduced it from $125 to $75. And we personally know guys that, that want it. Yeah. You know, another thing, when you're scoring a turkey, get somebody to help you. It's easier with oh, two. Oh, yes. It's easier with two people, if not three. Yep. Try not to do it by yourself. There's also, you you can Google it. You can go, there's there's turkey calculators on, on here that you can just punch it in. And it does it for you. It's all that. Yep. All right, that's going to wrap it up. And uh, we'll see y'all next week right here for another Tennessee Outside short clip. Thanks.